Hey folks and welcome back. This will be a quick video. In my last installment, I was talking about checking the uh, IF transformers. The uh, first and second in this position, this is the uh, first IF transformer. And the uh, second IF transformer resides here. You can refer to the uh, cutaway and I'll label those. But doing some due diligence on the first IF, the secondary is open. And it's also wired incorrectly as well. That is the uh, transformer on the primary side. I'll show you a couple clues here in just a moment. Again, I've got my meter set on DC resistance. My uh, secondary winding is this location here back to the uh, back winding. And you can see it's open. And we'll look at the uh, primary winding and get my hands out of the way. And you can see about 136, 137 ohms. Again, these transformers are not like your more modern type IF transformers. Again, as I mentioned in the previous video, the IF frequency as well is about 181.5 uh, kilocycles or kilohertz. I'll go ahead and continue to uh, trace these leads out and see how someone uh, kind of re-engineered this thing or attempted to, which may have led to the uh, secondary actually opening up. Let me show you the uh, work that was done, kind of a clue when you look at it. So here's my primary winding running uh, left to right, or in this case, in a horizontal position. And you can see that looks like a uh, new solder and someone has placed that back on the uh, screen grid of the six Delta six pins number one, two, three. And you can see how it was soldered on. That definitely does not look like factory. And uh, definitely the wrong location. Again, that being the uh, primary side of the uh, first IF. Or at least if I'm uh, looking at things correctly, it appears to be wrong. More uh, due diligence on my part will follow. I'm going to go ahead and try to get this out. And once I'm uh, successful or not successful, I'll bring you guys back. Flip it over and see if I can pull this thing out now. You guys can see I've got a blue alignment location as well. And uh, there we have it. Hopefully to be something simple, uh, nothing more than just a uh, cold solder joint. I can see a uh, retaining ring. Oh, by the way, before I conclude the video, I wanted to do some deep cleaning on the chassis. And uh, you can see I was able to uh, polish the uh, turd just a little bit in a couple areas. So uh, this thing may uh, clean up rather well once I uh, get the uh, components off the top side.